In section 15.6, we are exploring surface integrals. So as we begin our exploration of this section, it's going to be helpful to keep curves, arc length, and line integrals in mind as we explore surfaces, surface area, and surface integrals. And why, you might ask? And that's a great question. So what we're about to discover is that surfaces have parallels to what we already know about curves, just lifted up one dimension. So let's consider some of these parallel concepts between curves in R2 and surfaces in R3. So for an arc length in R2, this is going to be parallel to the surface area in R3. And for line integrals in R2, we're going to see that this is parallel to surface integrals in R3. And last but not least, in R2, we looked at one parameter descriptions. And in R3, we're going to look at two parameter descriptions. So we're already beginning to see those parallels between R2 and R3 and how we're going to lift up one dimension. So let's take a closer look.